Hello Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I'm going to take a look at your situation with you and your person in mind. Remember that this is a general reading, so it may or may not resonate for everybody. But you can always take a look at your other placements. You may find some messages there for you. And if you're interested in a personal reading much like this, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all, okay? So, Virgo, I see that there's been a breakup or a separation here. And I get that at one point you were chasing this person. And you were trying to pursue them. You were really interested in them. And you wanted to see where things would go with this person. Because I get that you felt as though there was something there. And I'm seeing that... Um, in your recent past, you have decided to uh, move into a new direction here. There was a risk taken to go towards the unknown and to see what happens next. And uh, I get that you're moving towards somebody here who is, I'm seeing Queen of Wands and I'm seeing Queen of Cups. So I kind of feel like this is the same person with like two different personalities. Like one moment they're very quiet, reserved. The next moment they're like loud, out there. Um, they're, they have a lot of things going on. And um, I see that you're walking away from your emotions. You're um, separating yourself from that uh, situation and you're putting an end to it you're moving forward because you feel like there's you feel like you deserve more you're starting to realize that you deserve more in a situation because you were the one that was always putting in the work and always chasing this person and uh, messaging them first and asking to to hang out and things like that so now you're starting to realize like hey um, maybe I took I, I did things too too quickly or I should have been hesitant. I shouldn't have jumped in all the way. I shouldn't have um, went all in on this person here. So I see that in your person's energy here. We have Page of Discs, which is Capricorn, Virgo, and Taurus energy. I'm seeing that they they see they see the value in you okay they do um they feel like you're someone who's very attractive beautiful or handsome and they acknowledge that and i see this person actually wanting to start things small here they are interested but i see them wanting to learn how to um how to be in a commitment. I get that this person has been hurt before and they have their walls up, they have their guards up in terms of relationships and partnerships here, but they feel like you're someone who, you're somebody who they could be with. They feel like you're somebody they could be with in the long term or somebody who there is marriage potential here with the Four of Wands and Justice. So I see that this person wants to make an offer. They are wanting to make a proposal. I see that they are um, thinking about it. They're also trying to make sense if the, of things to see if this is actually something that will um, work out in the long term here but they're very hesitant there because they have these walls up they have their guards up and it's almost like they're ready for the worst case scenario so they have this wand here like they're ready to fight or they're ready for combat but I see like you're just trying to show this person love like you don't want to do this person wrong you're not there to hurt them but they're very jaded in terms of a situation, I see like you're trying to like 
break through the mold of things here but I see this person actually wanting to make an offer to you that can grow into something more um, but it is a small offer it's something small that they want to give you and um, to show you that they are for real at this time and they're feeling ready so This is, wow, yeah, this is good news coming towards you. Eight of Wands and Six of Wands, this is exactly what you've been waiting for. It's like, this is sudden, it's very sudden, it's very quick communication, lots of communication at that. There's, there's lots of communication, like double text, triple text, paragraphs coming in, and you're going to feel like you just... Um, things are finally start to go your way you're getting recognition you're getting what you wanted that victory six of wands you're winning you're winning the person that you've been chasing or pursuing now things are starting to move faster here because now um and this is really good news you're going to be super happy super happy about this ten of cups three of cups eight of wands are you kidding me like I literally hear someone saying like are you kidding me like in disbelief like you're in disbelief that this person is is um, making this offer to to you this like proposal because you've been feeling frustrated for some time um, even possibly lacking confidence here there's been fear um, ego or pride or jealousy that has been starting to get in the way here but now you're you're getting some type of recognition here you're getting some really good news and it's this it's what you've been envisioning for your future it's what you've been uh pursuing you've been pursuing for for this happily ever after for this um celebration so i see that this is something worth celebrating about um I see that this is there's other people involved here that are going to be very happy for this um, celebration and I see like a party happening I see like some a party coming up for someone uh, and I see lots of communication coming in that's gonna make you really really happy having fun and um, I get that it's enlightening you you're getting some clarity because now you see the hope you see that light at the end of the tunnel with that star card because things have been a struggle there's been chaos there's been um breakdowns but now the start is here and now i see that there is renewal here in a situation where you've started to feel like you were getting drained and there's been um you've been putting in a lot of the effort a lot of the work with that ten of wands so but this is the end is in sight the end is in sight here so i see that there's a, cul a culmination coming up there's a completion happening um, a wish fulfillment at that you are i see that this is there's still something though that is it's like an offer that's being given to you, but it's going to require also some patience as well. Like, it's like somebody saying, like, I want to give you this, but I need some more time. So you see that light, you see that hope, you're starting to feel hopeful, um, but you're still pretty, you're not giving up on a situation. I see you and this person are not giving up on each other because you feel like this is a wish fulfillment. And um, I see that, like, somebody feels like, yeah, like there's other people, but there's no one like you or there's no one like that person. And I see that there's more effort that's going to be putting in here with that eight of discs. There's going to be some hard work and dedication. And so you're you're going to see some you're going to see some some uh, progress that is going to make you feel hopeful in the situation. And this is actions. This is not words. This is something that you can see something that you can touch that is making things more clear here but it's still going to be a struggle with that five of wands it still needs patience with the star card here is i see that it's still going to be a little bit of a struggle to get towards um uh, this commitment here 
because there's other factors involved which I see could have to do with friends. I'm seeing something about friendship. We have the coffee cup, meeting and conversing, savoring the moment, feeling uplifted, and friendship. So I see that um, the fight is still not over. There's like um, a sense of competition but also empowerment like I see that you're receiving some type of empowerment you know exactly how to um, get to where you want you're playing your cards right in a situation to get to where you want and I see that um, I see that somebody wants to fight for this somebody doesn't want to lose the other person so I see that you two are could be working together in order to in order to um, get a breakthrough moment here so I'm seeing it's like you're getting what you want but it comes with like a but but it's it because it requires more patience and there's other factors involved that has to do with friendships so let's get some details here For Virgo, I'm seeing Aquarius, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Virgo, and Taurus. Okay, we got a few cards here. So there's been, um, this is someone from the past. Um, I see that there's been a separation or breakup, um, silent treatment with someone from the past. You or this person could be somebody who has um, blonde hair, or could have light features or even red hair. And I see that you're pursuing something, you're being very serious and you're getting some type of victory. You're determined to win. You're determined to um, get what it is that you want. And it feels like this is true love. You're seeing a wish fulfillment here. The one uh, in the next few weeks, I see like a lot of love, true love here after feeling um, frustrated. But I see that this is going to take some more work here. It's going to take some more work to try to make things um, work and not like uh, have conflicts or uh, putting yourself in a competition where you don't need to be, if that makes any sense. You could work with this person or you could have met this person through work. So... Let's get some more cards for you guys. With this Five of Wands, I'm kind of taking this as advice for you guys here that has to do with instead of like uh, being combative or argumentative, um, and this doesn't have to just apply to you, it could be cross watcher, but try to like work together and not putting yourself in a position of competition where there is none. That's what I'm hearing. okay so yeah this is someone from the past it's a past life relationship you have known each other before and this is why it feels like it's true love it feels like you've known this person for a long time I see you're making some sort of effort here because you feel like this is worth taking the steps that you need to take um, and making some effort I see your person here in their energy, we have love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. So they see, um, I see that they, they, they notice your value because they know that you're somebody who is respectable or they feel like you have a lot of self-respect um, or this could be your person here and um, this is something that you see in them. But this is, I see that we have forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. So there's um, something that 
has to be forgiven in order to move forward or otherwise it's just not really going to work out but i see in your outcome we have passion allow your heart and soul to sing with joy so you and this person like you can't keep your hands off each other i see that um you two are going to end up being together so this is what i'm getting for you guys if you like this reading, please comment, like, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can be updated for future videos. Let me know if it resonated, and I hope that you found some guidance or clarity in your situation, and thank you for watching. Bye.